video, I'm going to just show you how I cover my hooks to make it nice and cushiony and soft. Your hand will be less tired. So let's get the party started. Hello everyone, this is Yolanda from the Outcrafts channel. Today I'm just going to give you a little quick tip of what I do. A lot of people have asked me when they watch my videos, like they'll say, hey, what's that? Um, where did you get that cushion or where did you th get the hook cover? Um, when I started crocheting years ago, they didn't have um, the crochet covers. I think Clover sells them now. But even some of those are really small and they don't fit on the bigger hooks or some of them, the smaller hooks, they're way too tiny and it just slides right off. So what I do, I love crocheting with my tiny hooks when I do thread stuff. And so this is, the little hooks are, I, they really kill your hands. It's because you're grabbing onto something so tight that your hand has to be like, harder squeeze harder and then the bigger hooks even though you're not holding something really big they're still hard so this hard surface kind of hurts your hands that's one of the reasons um, I mean I like the clay uh, covers on the hooks but I can't use them for too long because um, I like to have it cushiony and so what I did when I started doing the crocheting years ago they didn't have this so I wanted something soft because it's like having inserts in your shoes you know how they're cushiony and it feels good so what I do, since I can't, couldn't find them, and these are a lot cheaper than buying the crochet hook covers, I just get these gel or pencil, pencil pillows, they call them. They're actual for pens or pencils when you put this. So when you write, you don't get this big old bump, which I already have, so it doesn't matter. So what I do, because of these, um, let me open this. Um, these won't fit. It'll just slide right off. So, and if you keep trying to hold it tight to keep it on that, that's defeating the purpose because you're cramping your hand. So what I do is just get some rubber bands, I have tons of these, and I just get um, my rubber band and fold it like this, get my hook, whichever hook it's going to be, and just wrap it around a few times, okay? Just keep wrapping it around like that, okay? So now it's wrapped there, and if you want, you could scoot it down so that you could see you can still see what number hook it is and what I like about this is that like I said I love the cushiony feel just throw it like that now you have some of this and what this will do this will grip the gel so it keeps it in place so that when you're crocheting you've seen me crochet I could just keep crocheting and then with the rubber band you could slide it forward more if you need to or back more depending on how you hold your hook and then if it's covered your gel you could just roll it back and you could still see what size it is, okay? So once I have the rubber band here, all I do is slide this cover on and it's in place. See, it's not going anywhere. You could shake it, it still stays there. And if it's covered this way, sometimes I move my hand in different positions. I can either slide it back to see what hook it is. If it's covered, I can just lift it and I can see what hook it is. So this is just a tip I have. I know a lot of people have asked me if you are having trouble with cramping or your hands getting tired try this it makes a big difference and then that way you could use even small hooks large hooks it doesn't matter I have this on this end hook I put two of these because of the way I hold a hook it's different sometimes I go this way sometimes I hold it like a pencil so you could see that I really want to have something cushiony and I want this to cushion the back of my hand when I hold it this way so anyway I hope this really helps I want you to try it like I said the other day I even saw these at the dollar store there was like 10 of them for a dollar so you can't beat that it's a lot cheaper than buying the crochet hooks that don't always work so anyway thank you for watching have a great day and remember always that God loves you